Can a free password manager be any good, really? Let's find out. So you probably know me as a 1Password user, I have been for quite a long time now, but when Roboform got in touch and asked to sponsor this channel in exchange for a very fair, honest appraisal of their password manager, I said yes. Although I did make it pretty clear that it's going to be quite a difficult sell, because I am a big fan of 1Password. I need lots of convincing, so let's get straight into it. If you've never heard of Roboform before, you may be surprised to hear that they've been around for 20 years, and in that time they have never been hacked. But it gets better, because Roboform has a free option, which most password managers abandoned a long time ago. Having said that, I wouldn't let the free version of Roboform completely cloud your decision-making process when you're choosing a password manager. Remember, you need something that can raise your cybersecurity, but also help you be more productive. And the list of things that you get with Roboform Everywhere, which is the paid version, is impressive. You get syncing across all devices, cloud backup, secure shared folder, you can grant emergency access to people, you get web access, priority 24-7 support. Don't discount that stuff just because there's a free version, because you get a lot for your money. These prices are a bit of an approximation because they do always have very tasty deals on, but at the moment it's about £1.50 per month for individuals, around £3 per month for families, and roughly £2.60 per month, or per user per month, for businesses. Now, if you're immediately interested by that pricing, I've got even better news. Working with Roboform on this video enabled me to get a big discount for you guys of 42%. So if you wanna go and grab it now, there's a link in the description, you can go and get that 42% discount, but I'd recommend watching on just to make sure this is right for you. The setup process for Roboform was super straightforward. Because I'm a 1Password user, I didn't want to sit there and plow in all of my usernames and passwords individually. That would have taken for ages. Thankfully though, there is an import option and it's got lots of different services you can connect with. But for 1Password, it was simply a case of exporting all of my password details into a CSV file and then importing that CSV file into Roboform. And once you've done that, you've then got the Roboform app on your computer. It's compatible with Macs, with Windows, with Linux, mobile devices, iOS, Android. Basically, if you've got a device, Roboform should work on it. And one of the biggest things that strikes you about Roboform is how easy it is to use. So yes, yeah, some password managers have a whole wealth of features. One password is a bit like that, but occasionally that can be a little bit overwhelming. Roboform isn't, it's very simple to use. You could argue that it could do with a little bit of updating interface wise, but that's a bit of a aesthetic thing. It's a matter of opinion, really. I just love the fact that you can jump into it and start using it without trying to work out where everything is. It's also worth mentioning that Roboform has a fantastic one-click login feature. And this is a huge time-saving thing, so it means you can very quickly log into all of your favourite websites, your favourite web apps, whatever it is that you need to get into very quickly. And you can access that one-click functionality through browsers like Chrome, thanks to the Roboform extension. You just open Chrome, click once, and you're logged in straight away. And you can use that same browser extension to create new passwords, so when you sign up for a new service or a new website, you can use Roboform to pick a very secure password for you, again, incredibly quickly. And for someone like me who has, like I say, loads of different devices and you wouldn't believe how many websites and web apps that I have to log into each day, the ability to do so with one click is just, I was going to say life-changing. It's not life-changing, but it's a massive productivity boost. The question is whether or not you can get away with that free version if, unlike me, you don't have loads of different devices and you're happy just to use one computer. That massive list of features from the free version is a bit of a no-brainer. But I know you've got one, or maybe two questions. Firstly, is it better than 1Password? And secondly, will I switch from 1Password to Roboform? Straight up, guys, these are very similar services. Again, I've got a list here. So, they both offer 256-bit 
AES encryption. And both services have a zero knowledge policy about your master password, so only you know that password. The only difference between the two when it comes to this is the fact that one password has a 128 bit secret key, which is this long string of numbers and letters that you get when you first sign up to the service. Again, only you have knowledge of that, but it does raise the question, is one password more secure than RoboForm because of this secret key? I don't think it is. I personally think that the zero knowledge policy about the master password on both of these services is enough. As long as you make sure it's very secure and you only keep it knowledgeable to yourself, then you're in good hands. Moving on to the other features, they both offer integration with the big two-factor authentication services. One Password does offer native form filling in Mac OS, whereas you can't do that in RoboForm at the moment. They do have it for Windows, but not for Macs. However, they both have very neat ways of checking your password health. On One Password, it's called Watchtower, and on RoboForm, it's called security suite. And Watchtower is a bit prettier, yes, but that's just an aesthetics thing again. It doesn't really matter. Security Center on RoboForm is absolutely fantastic. You can very quickly find weak passwords, reused passwords, and complete duplicates of login information. And getting rid of that stuff and fixing those weak passwords is so, so easy. When it comes to account recovery, which is when you lose your login details completely to RoboForm or 1Password or something happens and you can't get in, they both take quite different approaches. 1Password has a very, let's be honest, old school method of having a PDF called your emergency kit, which you refer to if the worst happens. Whereas with RoboForm, the best thing you can do, and I think the most sensible thing you can do for this, is have that emergency contact. It's worth mentioning that RoboForm even even enables you to restore your master password if you've lost it completely, providing you're using your biometric security, you know, your thumbprint or your face ID on iOS or Android, they have a feature called Master Password Restore, which gets it back for you completely securely. But if we get back to the similarities, like I mentioned earlier, they both run on pretty much any platform that matters. They've got fantastic mobile apps. To put it mildly, guys, there's not much separating 1Password and RoboForm everywhere. So where do you go from here? I can't tell you what's best for you in terms of RoboForm and 1Password or any of the other password managers out there. It's a very subjective personal thing. However, if I wasn't using 1Password and if I was using something completely different like Keychain on the Mac and I suddenly needed cross-platform compatibility, if this was the first time I came across RoboForm, I would have snapped it up. I think the free version is absolutely fantastic. It's so, so generous. However, if you do want more functionality and you want to benefit from the things like multi-device syncing and two-factor authentication and that account recovery stuff, then RoboForm Everywhere still is very well priced. Pound for pound and dollar for dollar, it's cheaper than 1Password, whether you're going for the individual plan or the family plan, or even the stuff for teams and businesses. And in fact, the only reason I'm not switching from 1Password to RoboForm today is because I'm so busy and I have about 8,000 devices. However, when things start to die down a little bit, hopefully, fingers crossed, and I have a bit more time on my hands, well, stay tuned. And remember, if you want to benefit from that huge 42% discount on RoboForm everywhere, just click the link in the description.